An important issue making its way onto ballots in Detroit is Proposal N. The proposal promises to restore homes in good conditions and rid the bad ones. But not everyone is on board. CW50's Chris Walker has more. Proposal N is about Detroit neighborhoods and cleaning up the eyesores, driving property values down in the city. But some community advocates are calling on Detroiters to vote no on the $250 million bond proposal while telling city officials to go back to the drawing board on a new demolition plan. There are 22,000 abandoned homes in the city of Detroit. Under the Neighborhood Improvement Plan, also known as Proposal N, Mayor Mike Duggan says 8,000 homes can be saved and another 8,000 will be torn down with no tax increase. But opponents are making bold claims and calling Proposal N a sham. One of the reasons that this opposition was formed is because of the over-appraisal, a minimum of $600 million in over-appraisal of Detroit properties that resulted in thousands of properties being foreclosed upon. Back in July, Mayor Duggan presented Proposal N's goals to create jobs for Detroit contractors and prioritize restoring structurally sound homes and tackle blight. Every year, we lose a thousand of those good houses. We lose them to vandals, we lose them to arson, we lose them to the weather. Community organizations call them out and make us whole say if Proposal N passes, it will cause a decline of black home ownership in Detroit and a predominantly black city. Detroiters cannot trust Mayor Duggan's administration again in terms of what is viewed by some as a property tax scam to get another $250 million. If Proposal N passes November 3rd, City Council will have oversight of the program, not the Detroit Land Bank Authority. Reporting in Detroit, Chris Walker, CW50 News at 10.